Sardinia didn't start as we had planned. This is about a week and a bit beyond that we're recording this, but Zeus sort of broke down and we were stranded for a few days as we waited for recovery. Stranded. Stranded, yeah. In a beautiful park up by the ocean. Yes, I will insert some drone shots here. <laughs> we recorded the recovery of Zeus and everything's going on. And then the GoPro's SD card corrupted and we lost everything. So I'll insert a few clips from my phone of just getting picked up and what we went through. But we're kind of hopping ahead a little bit a few days into Sardinia. We're off to the hotel. We're going to sort out our own car hire, I think, so we can go and explore because I think we might be a few days. We have arrived at our hotel, which actually is pretty nice. I miss you. Um, we miss Zeus though, we'd rather be in Zeus travelling around. It was someone's bright idea to give Christy multiple coffees today. So I have currently locked him out on our balcony as this is the situation. <laughs> We're just going to the reception desk to go and get a taxi to the airport to pick up a hire car for the next three days. We can still go and explore. Sad times. Uh, we've had to hire a car and it's ended up being a BMW, which is actually pretty nice inside. So Haley's pretty happy. I know I said I miss Zeus, <laughs> but this is quite nice. Today has been a ridiculous day. So having dropped the van at the garage after the first tow truck tried to pick it up and couldn't because it was too small. The second tow truck came back, managed to pick it up took it to the garage. We told them what we thought was wrong with it, but they didn't check anything, they just towed it. Got to the garage, did some Google Translate things with the Italian man who's very helpful and very friendly. And he said, it's probably gonna be a few days before we can sort it out. We managed to sort out some car hire ourselves because they couldn't. So we figured we've got a few days to kill, we'll hire a car and we can still go and explore some of the island. It's got a taxi there and went and picked up the car, which we booked till Wednesday, it's now Monday. Drove back to the garage where Zeus is to go and get some clothes and bits out of him. When we were back there, they actually had Zeus in the workshop and were looking at him to diagnose what had gone wrong. And the guy translated to us and showed us that the blast of like what we thought was steam and then the spray of fluid that came out of the engine when we were like driving was an air conditioning pipe melting on the engine. So there's nothing wrong with the engine <laughs> and you didn't need to be towed, which yeah, seems to have now been a very expensive and pointless operation for everyone involved. Today is a new day. Just washing my face in an actual sink where I can keep the water running as long as I like. <laughs> Living our best life. So, 323 euros later, <laughs> and Haley's got to drive him back to the hotel all on her own. We've got our little house back. 323 euros, so quite expensive for getting the aircon fixed. Hey, it is what it is. Could have been a lot worse and a lot more expensive. So, off we go. Well, after a couple of eventful days, we're chilling in the hotel room with some snacks. We got Zeus back, but we had this hotel room for tonight anyway, so we figured we'd enjoy it. They've got a really nice breakfast here. And a shower. And a shower, which is very good as well. And a toilet and a that's not overflowing. <laughs> and a toilet that's not currently full and in need of emptying. Bye bye hotel. Back to very nice hotel. Well, not been in the van for three days, so having to sort out of the fridge. It smells so bad. Sorting all this shit out and then, I don't know, sorting the rest of the van out and then getting on the road. We're back, baby! It's 
arrived at our potential park up on a very bumpy track with some narrow bushes and things. Zeus got a bit scraped up, didn't he? Got PTSD um, from the last dirt. <laughs> yeah. One problem with having to do your washing in the van when your clothes haven't dried properly in the dryer, you end up having to hang them around. Oh, there's more in there. Yeah. We've both just spent the last hour or so in the van doing work and bits. So we've just come outside to play a good old fashioned game of catch. First night back in Zeus, my lovely boyfriend has made me coffee in bed again because he's very good to me. Cheers. <laughs> What's the plan today, Christy? I don't actually know. As many days start, we don't have a huge plan. I think we are going to work our way kind of northwest. But yeah, just take it, take it easy today, I think. Embrace being back in Zeus. Mm, sounds good to me. <laughs> Just heading to the park up, but we're having a quick stop off to pick up some snacks. Because this one always wants snacks. I'm so hungry, we've um, not had lunch yet. Yeah, we hadn't had lunch and it's like three o'clock or something. You'd think that living in a van would mean that we don't eat really good food, but we are too much foodies. We do not do that. <laughs> That's why all of our money goes on food every month. Man's gone outside into the wind. He's gonna get blown away. Oh, bye! Christy's setting up our surround sound for our home cinema. We've got the best movie of all. I'm sure you'll recognize this. <laughs> Who doesn't? Yeah. 